Fred got a new tattoo. I'm concerned. Oh, Jesus. Fred, you just met her last night. I love her. You love her after one night. She's a gymnast. You look terrible. At least I still have on my face. That her? Yes. She's pretty cool, huh? No, she's a complete psycho. What a fool. To think you were ready. Father. Hey! You have betrayed the express command of your king. Through your arrogance and stupidity, you have opened these peaceful realms and innocent lives to the horror and desolation of war! You are unworthy of these realms, unworthy of your title! You are unworthy of the loved ones you have betrayed. You want to get laid? You really don't have to pretend to be interested in a pyramid scam. I mean, you could just say, "Hey, I'm trying to get laid." <laughs> I could, I could say that, right? If I wanted to get laid. Let me see your license and registration. I like your gun. What? Unfortunately, he is, he is not human. For well, that would require the one thing that David will never have. A soul. I understand human emotions. Although I do not feel them myself. I love this weapon more than any other thing in the whole wide world. You wanna know why? No. It's memorable. We've got a couple of swords at your ex-girlfriend's wedding. They will never, ever forget it. That's funny, Wade. I think you confuse me with someone who gives a shit. <laughs> Granted, it's, it's probably not as intimidating as having a gun or bone claws or the fingernails of a bag lady. Look easy. What can you do, David? I can do almost anything that could possibly be asked of me. I can assist your employees. I can make your organization more efficient. I can carry out directives that my human counterparts might find distressing or unethical. What makes you sad? War. Poverty. Cruelty. Unnecessary violence. Petro Crimea. A gentleman would at least offer to buy me a drink first. <laughs> This allows me to be more efficient and capable and makes it easier for my human counterparts to interact with me. Oh, don't worry, Nancy. More people die driving than flying. How about from impaling? It'd be nice. Or be your approximation of nice. Would you like a bucket? Oh, gentlemen. Metrochromio is in reference to your eyes, which I have to say are stunning. 
One green, one blue. It's a mutation. It's a very groovy mutation. I've got news for you, Amy. You are a mutant. First you proposition a girl, and then you call her deformed. How is that seduction technique working for you? I'll tell you in the morning. <laughs> No, no, seriously, though, you mustn't knock it. Mutation took us from single-celled organisms to being the dominant form of reproductive life on this planet. Infinite forms of variation with each generation all through mutation.